Hi guys, welcome back to Family Kids Tea. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how to paint a tropical sunset painting. Yeah, so it's a super fun activity to do during quarantine and the materials or paints or art supplies that you're going to be needing are some, is some red paint. Mm, where's the orange paint? <laughs> orange paint. Mm. Or yellow or he color it's spelled as yellow and then o c h r e yellow or he and um just some normal yellow paint so and you'll also be needing some black paint if you don't have um a black marker you can use black paint like me and you'll also be needing a black pen and a paintbrush at least about this thick um, you can measure that to my fingers, yeah. And that's all that you'll be needing. Oh, yeah, before that, I'll, I'll, I almost forgot to tell you guys, if you want to get this size paper, because I think so, it's better if you use it, you fold an A4 paper, okay, exactly at top. Okay, so you get the size of it. You can just cut it or um, tear it if you're good at tearing. And yeah, so that's all you'll be needing. So let's get started. Okay guys, so now as you can see, I have the paints lined up in a row. And so the first paint that you're gonna be needing is some red paint. Dip it in the water a little bit. And you get some paint. Okay, so I got some on my brush. And I, as you can see, I have a testing paper behind to check whether it's watery or the paint isn't too dry. So I'm just going to test it. I think so. it's a little too watery. Okay, now it's okay. So let's start. I'm just going to keep on painting it. Side strokes. Okay, you guys can use side strokes, which I think would be better. Or otherwise, um, it will be a bit hard for you to do it up and down. So we're just going to keep on doing side strokes and yeah. Okay. Paint, 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 paint. What type of song is that? Fatima's created up song. Okay, you guys saw me do up and down just now. That was actually because um, I... Uh, saw that it was a little bit too light over here, so that's why. <laughs> okay. okay, so paint, 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 paint. We're bored in quarantine, so we need to sing, right? <laughs> I don't know, but we sure do need to stay active. Non, do not be a couch potato. Okay, so let's move on to the next color, which is orange. So it's really like an orange color. You know those orange colors where, um, you know, oranges, the orange fruit? Uh, yeah, this color is really like that fruit. So, yeah, for some reason, I don't know why, but for some reason. Okay, I got a lot. Okay, now we're going to paint. Okay, so you guys can mix it in from where you, like, from the last stroke you ended up at the red, but from there... It's supposed to be a bit light. For me, it's a bit dark because, uh, like, for my painting, it turned out a little bit dark. But that's okay because um, I'm using poster colors. And actually, the darker you're painting, the better. I think so. You guys should um, blend it in with a little bit of light color. So, yeah, okay. Orange was pretty fast, but I think so. It's a little bit too dry. I want to add some water to it. Okay, yeah, that is perfect. Okay, now let's wash our brush and move on to the last color, which is... Oh, not the last color. Sorry about that. I mean, the second last color, which is yellow or gray. So let's get some onto the brush. I normally take some from the side because, yeah, <laughs> But it's a little bit dry, so I might just take a little bit from the bottom. Okay. So I'll just wet it a little bit and paint. Oh, yeah. This color is perfect. This is how you're supposed to blend it in. But from the bottom, it's not supposed to be too light. So, yeah. I'm just going to paint because I don't think so. it's that light from the bottom either. 
So yeah, I added a little bit less paint. So we might just need a little bit more. Just gonna get a little. I think so I need some water. <laughs> Look at the water's color. <laughs> it's a reddish yellow. I don't know. It's not really yellow. I think so it's red. I, 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 I was supposed to say orange. Today I'm speaking wrong words out of my tongue. What happened to my tongue? Probably something. Hmm. So let's just paint side strokes. Oh, we got some red. That's okay. I think so it's from the water. So yeah. Just gonna blend it in through all. So that looks nice. And the red a little. From the orange. And from the normal color. Okay, so I think so we can move on to the next color because it seems like this color is already done. So this is our last and final color. Let's wash the brush. And I think so I should use the testing paper to get some of the paint out. Because yellow is a light color. So I'm gonna get some yellow paint. Get it! Get it! It's so nice. I actually like this color. Why am I adding the water later? <laughs> okay, guys, you're supposed to add the water first, but eventually I didn't. Something happened to me. <laughs> okay, so that's okay. But at least we got our painting. I love this color, actually. It's pretty nice, but my favorite color is pink. Last time it used to be purple, so now it's pink for some reason. It changed. Okay, let's paint, paint, paint. Okay, I think so we're pretty much done. I'll just blend in the colors a little to give it a last touch. Okay, so let's remove the testing paper and testing sheet or paper and move. Okay, so we got that out. Okay, so before you do the next step, you have to let the painting dry. So, um, I'll let the painting dry for about 20 to 15 to 20 minutes, and I'll see it when it's done drying. Okay, guys, so now the painting has dried, and now we're going to make this tree. And so, yeah, let's start. Okay, so we'll be needing to make guidelines for the trunk. You need to make guidelines first, like two dots over here and like almost at the orange yellow I think so over here I think so maybe that. yeah perfect and um two dots here so that you know where you're gonna do it okay so bring it down slowly slow and steady okay good slow and steady perfect wow that's really good Okay, so next you're going to make an X. Okay, so I'm just going to use the testing paper to show you guys how it's actually going to look. Okay, so here you have your tree trunk and you have an X. Okay, so you bring out four lines which are should be mostly the same length, okay? And then you go, you do it like this. Okay, let's put this over there first. You do it like this. Like you put lines, okay? You put lines on it, and then you just do a double layer on it, again, and then you just do the same thing on the other side, but the leaves are like this, and then you make it a little bit better from the top. So you do it on all four, and that's how, you're, how it will look. So let's continue doing this, okay? Like that, mm -hmm, perfect. Like this good like this perfect <laughs> perfect okay i think so it can be a little bit longer this one too. Okay. now let's start doing this you get you can do the same thing on all four leaves you can give it a little bit of a natural look too by making by making some extra leaves like this so that you can start a new one okay so i guess i'll just see you guys when i'm done um doing this whole painting okay guys so i finished doing um the 
for leaves, I think. I don't know what they're called, but yeah. Okay, so I'm going to be using a paintbrush with, which has a tip, which is a little bit sharp. Not really, but I think so. it's the sh best paintbrush to use for me. Okay, I might want to fix this chunk a little bit, like that. But I'm just going to paint it in so that um, it's not going to show. So let's just close the pen and put it there. And get our black paint. I'm going to get some. Or a black marker if you have one. And we're just going to paint it all. Try to be careful. Careful, careful, carefully. <laughs> carefully, carefully, carefully. And there. Okay, so I just paint it in. I think so. We mostly got it. I think so. I might want to put a paper beneath it. Oh, it's fine actually. So let's just get it through. I think so. I might want to put a paper and then put it there. Okay, there. Now I'm just gonna slightly go down and perfect. This is nice. I like it. As you can see, it's really beautiful. Uh oh, that's alright. Fix it like that. Okay, so don't worry if you make a mistake like me just now. You can try to fix it. You don't have to start over the painting again. But yeah, try not to make a mistake. If you do, just try to fix it. Okay, so I think so that should be the end of this video. And there we go. That's our tropical sunset. I hope you guys like this video. Like, share, and subscribe. Goodbye.